What do you want? Um, just wanted to talk. I just didn't want to leave it like that. Is there anything else to say? Yeah. I love you. I love you, Adam, not him. Is there somebody else here? No. But I keep your voice down if they want the neighbours to hear what you've done. So you're still angry then? I'm still angry, yeah. Did you hear what I said about me loving you? Yep. I really want to be with you. Please, if there is any way that we can get through this, I will do anything. Anything? Yeah. Hand that watch into the police. What? You heard. Tell them you found it in the woods. I can't. Why not? There's a teenage girl out there who thinks her dad's still alive. That he did a runner and left her without saying a word. Doesn't she deserve the truth? Hand it into the police and let's move on with our lives. Tell them you found it in the woods this afternoon. I can't. Why not? Because I got rid of it. Where? I threw it away. It's probably a landfill now. Well, I guess that's that. You've made your choice. No, I... Adam, come on. It doesn't have to be like that. I didn't have a choice. You had a choice. Between protecting your ex or saving your marriage. <laughs> no, because I don't want this to be the end. He couldn't have planned this any better because he knows if I go to the police, I'd drop you in it. I want you to go. Please, Adam. I, I want you to go. You little... How, how'd you even get a bazooka? I thought they weren't available on this rank. Well, you kill me enough for one day, so I'm signing off, Paul. Yeah, you too. You all right? Yeah, was that grand? <laughs> yeah. Kind of regretting giving her that old console now. She's not a very gracious winner. Ah, oh, well, it's good that she can keep in touch with the kids, so... Yeah, except Max has told her how to cheat. Oh. What's happened? Nothing. Why are your eyes leaking? Come on, what is it? I've messed up really bad. I think me and Adam are finished. Do I have to go give him a slap? No, it's... no. <laughs> it's my fault. I've just... I've hurt him really bad. It's just welcome to married life. I mean, it's not all plain sailing, is it? Just give him time to sulk and... He'll come round. Poison that in, is it? We're about to cancel the stag and hen do, so we're going to spend our last night of freedom together. You all right, mate? I'm not your mate. I thought we were all right now. We'll never be all right. And we'll never be mates, OK? So you better stay out of my face. You know, all I wanted was for Sarah to know you for what you are. And now she does, she's still protecting you. You're welcome to each other. <laughs> <laughs>